Hello guys, I'm Winston. Today I'm going to talk about bees, wasps, and hornets. Wait, I'm not talking about the F-18 hornets, okay? Do not think of that. Because I am not talking about aircrafts today. I am talking about bees, wasps, and not aircraft hornets. Got it? Okay. Good thing you looked at it. I worked very hard on it, but I didn't like this much, but I very worked hard on it too. It's um a Lego bee, but I couldn't do a real bee, so I kind of did a robotic bee. So then I so let's put it aside. And today I'm talking about facts about them. Not everything about them. Got it? You got it. Okay. So the first fact is going to bees. Okay, so a lot of people think that they're afraid of bees and they say bees will always sting. That's actually fiction. Because only when a bee is very scared, they will bite you or sting you. But the worst thing about the fact, it's worse than you. Because when the bee stings you, the stinger removes, right? But when the stinger removes, the, there's a venom sack at the end. I mean, not the point where it's pointy but the back of it and then the venom sac is attached to all a lot of the bee's organs but if a bee stings you right the stinger removes right then the venom sac also gets removed so then it gets a lot of organs away from the bee's body and then, after the sting, the bee will quickly return to the hive. And it might not make it and die off the way. So how do you think that's sad? Sad! And then, if they even make it to the hive, they won't be able to survive. Because can a bee replace its organs? No. So then, the bee is dead, dead forever. And then, but you, you're a good reason you can remove the stinger. So the stinger doesn't keep putting venom into your body. So you can scratch it off or use a little metal plate to scratch it off. Or you can just pluck, easy. Um, but the bee died, and you didn't. Who has the more trouble, the bee or you? Remember to comment down below your answer, or else... And remember, subscribe and like, but it's not the end of the video. Remember. And the second fact, of course, I go in order, is going to wasps. And wasps, in some fiction books, are red, but their normal color isn't really red. They're yellow and black, just like a bee and wasp. Some say that a velvet ant is a wasp, because I don't even believe it. How can an ant be a wasp? Or the... Hulk tarantula. I mean, some people think it's a hawk. Some think it's a tarantula. The real thing is that it's a tarantula. But why is it called tarantula hawk? And even though a tarantula hawk is actually a wasp. Can you believe it? A tarantula that's a wasp. What the? 
Okay, yeah. Because, and the second, I mean the third fact, goes to all of these things. You know why? Because, guess what? Their stingers can kill. I mean, they can clear your wound using their venom. How can that be? So they're like, you take a bee, sting it, and then put the stinger back into the bee, and then it, it makes the wound on your hand less infection. So when there's the bee venom on it, when bacteria and viruses try to get into it, they cannot. Cool, huh? Cool. Yeah, we can be safe from infection. And remember, it does not work with the coronavirus. Do not work with the coronavirus. Also, it can cure your hand if your hand is very painful. So remember, thank the bees, wasps, and hornets. And our fourth fact. It's one of the craziest things about hornets and wasps. You know, some of them are so hungry that they eat their unhatched siblings. What? You just ate your siblings? Are you kidding me? You are such annoying bees, wasps, and hornets, but still, we should love them. And other facts about wasps and hornets, um, I'm not talking about them for right now. It goes back to bees. The Japanese bees, the Japanese bees, when moving their abdomen up and down, can heat up their body and burn their prey alive. Oh gosh. Please don't burn me. <laughs> because their body can, their body temperature can rise up to a whooping lava hot level of 115 to 80 degrees. You are so hot. I can't believe you can be that hot. Yeah, they're known as little killers. And the Seventh fact goes back to bees. This is one of the most deadliest ones of them all. Killer bees. Killer bees. One bee sting might just, yeah, you can deal with it, right? As I told you. But killer bees. Not so good. One killer bee bites you. Then they make a very big set that comes from your boom. And then, one million or trillion of them come to you. And then, what do you think you are? Think about it. You are turned into a bee monster. Yeah, a lot of bees on your body. You have to clear your body up, but it takes forever. But they sting you, right? The stingers are stuck on you. You have to take hours to take them off, right? So that's why killer bees are known as killer bees. And their venom and bite is as strong as a Madagascar lion. Lion. Think of that. One little killer bee bite you. Lion bite! <laughs> and the uh, eighth fact. We have three more facts to go. Three more facts. And then if I finish this fact, it's two more facts. So let's hurry up! And this other fact goes to all of them too. Hornets, wasps, bees, all types of them attack each other to feed their hive. That's true. Like for the giant killer hornet. They hunt 
other hornets or other bees, other wasps. Like um, a hornet versus yellow jackets. How would the fight be? Maybe I can tell you or maybe not. And then hornets actually take wasps and bees larvae and hornets even take bees to feed their little grubs. Yeah, the grubs that make those food into a acid that can feed up the hornets to make them have more energy. Oh God, those little grubs are monsters. Yeah, they are, they are monsters. Okay, yeah, but not so monster. And then the hornets are out of the stage today. We finished the hornet facts, but this fact goes to wasps. Get it? Wasps, okay? And there's another, a lot of rare wasps out there. You should look out for them. Their bites are painful and deadly. And then we're moving on to our next fact about bees. A queen bee can lay up to 15,000 eggs each day. How much would it lay in a year? I don't know, maybe over a trillion. Or a million. Yeah, millions are less than trillions. Yeah, but I'm not so good at math. And wasps out of the stage. There's a last fact. Last fact. I mean, this is not a fact, okay? Just kidding, it's a fact. Because I'm talking about facts. Killer bees like I told you about, were actually not a normal bee. It's a prototype. Yeah, it's a prototype. Scientists created it after 1969. The, the little killer bees, scientists wanted them to make more honey, but then some of them escaped and then spread across South America. And now South America is now covered by killer bees. So we finished our facts, but remember to subscribe and like. I'm Winston and see you next time for more teaching.